Hello guys, welcome to the next video on Maven tutorial for beginners. In this video, we will see how we can generate a jar file for our Maven project. So let's get started. So let's say I have a colleague and I want to make a jar file and give it to him. Now in order to uh, create a jar file from my Maven project, what steps I need to follow? First of all, I need to compile all my source file and then convert them into the dot class file so if you know whenever you compile a dot java file it will result in a dot class file so you need to compile all your java files and then in the next step you need to compile all your test files okay and it will also result in the dot class files right now the third step is to run the test and if any test fails you need to work on them and correct them and unless and until you have zero errors in test you need to you know rework on them right and the last step is to create a jar file which you can give to your colleague okay so let's see how we can do it so i'm going to go to my eclipse ide and first of all what I'm going to do is I'm going to open the folder in which my Maven project is so I'm going to right click and then go to the properties so once again I'm going to right click on my project and go to the properties here and in here you can just copy this location path from here and then go to your uh, folder explorer and then paste it there and then this will open your project in the you know windows explorer right so right now you can see it has the source folder and the target folder and your pom.xml files right so the first step is to clean your project so you can see there is a target folder here and let's see what happens when we give the clean command but first of all I will go to my test source file here so app test.java and in here there is a sample uh, you know fail here right so I just want to remove it so that my test will not fail right we just want to uh, you know compile our uh, maven project and let's see how we can do it we are more interested in in the steps rather than in the code right so now i'm going to save it and now the command which i'm going to give here is to clean my project so just right click on your project and in here run as in the run as you have uh, the bunch of maven commands here right you have maven build maven clean so you can give this maven clean command to clean your project right so the easy way is to just uh, click this option maven build and in the goals you can just write clean here okay and it's same as writing mvn clean on the command line right and when I run this command what it does is I'm going to go to my folder explorer once again and when this command will be successful you can see my target folder is deleted right so all the compiled files and all the jar files after compilation they are saved in this target folder and whenever we give the clean command it's going to clean all these uh, compiled uh, you know binaries and jar files okay so now our project is clean so you can see here in the output our build is success for uh, the clean command and now we are ready to uh, you know compile our app now the second command is to compile our source file right so once again right click your project and run as and choose this option maven build with three dots and in the goals this time you need to give this compile command 
So in the goals, I'm going to just write compile. And this compile command is going to compile my source files and create a class files for us for the source files. So let's run it. And once our uh, command is successfully run, you can see build success here. Then we can once again go to our folder explorer. You can see once again the target folder is created. Inside the target folder we have uh, this class folder, then com, then code bind, and then you have your app.class uh, file created by Maven for you, right? Now the third step is to compile your test files, right? So go to your project once again and right click your uh, project once again, go to run as once again, and then uh, just click Maven build with three dot once again. And in the goals this time to run or to compile the test, you just need to write test hyphen compile, okay? And it's going to compile the test for you, okay? So just run this command. And after this command is run successfully, we are going to see the folder explorer once again. So build success. Once again, let's go here and uh, we will go to our project and in the target folder, this time we have test hyphen class folder created inside the target folder and uh, inside the, you know, code bind package, we have this test class created for you. So app test dot class is created for you. So we have compiled our source files and we have compiled our uh, test files. Now we need to run the test. So how to run the test? You just need to right click your project once again and then run as and then maven build with three dot once again. And then this time you need to write test okay and it's same as giving the command mvn tests okay so just run this command test and let's see what's the result for us and we will wait for it and you can see the builds are success for this also right so now our tests are also passing in uh, you know reality we don't even have any test but let's say we have uh, you know test cases and test suits for our uh, classes that all are building successfully right once again we will go to our folder explorer and go to the target folder and you can see there is a third folder created inside the target folder which is surefire reports and inside the surefire reports you have a text file and the xml file and when you open this uh, text file, it's going to give you the result for the test. So you can see test run one, failure zero, error zero, skipped zero. Okay, so we don't have any error inside our test. Okay, so all the three steps are done. Our uh, source files are compiled, test files are compiled, and uh, our uh, tests are run successfully. Now, in order to create a jar file, there is a last command we need to give here is just go to run as once again, and then maven built. You can directly uh, click this maven install command for creating a jar file. But since we are following uh, this procedure of going to the maven uh, build here with three dots, here in the goals, once again, give the command install okay so just give the command install and then run it and once again your uh, project will be compiled all the tests will be run and once uh, you can see this uh, build success you can go to the folder explorer once again and go to the target once again and now you can see your jar file is created here, right? So the name of the jar file, as we have discussed earlier, will be the name of your uh, pro 
object for example your uh, artifact id then hyphen your uh, version 0.0.1 hyphen snapshot dot jar file right so in this way you can create a jar file for your project now let's see how we can do the exact same steps using command line so that you know what are the command issued by eclipse for creating these uh, files so if you remember in the third video i have shown you how to create your first maven project using command line and we named our project as first maven project so i'm going to work on the same project for the command line right so just go inside this uh, folder my first maven project and inside uh, this folder you will be able to find your uh, project name and inside this you have your uh, source folder and uh, pom.xml so just open the folder in which you have your uh, source folder and pom.xml file right because whenever we uh, issue some command it's going to search for this pom.xml file and the source folder and in here what you need to do is just press your shift key here so just press shift and then right click your mouse and you will be able to see this command open command window here okay and what it's going to do is i'm going to click this it's going to open the command prompt inside this folder so it's will open this command prompt and the directory we are currently in is this directory in which you are in so we are in the my maven project here right now in here we are going to follow the same procedure we are going to give mvn clean command first to clean our projects so just press enter and it's going to run uh, this clean command and it says build success so it's going to clean our project right the second is to compile our project so just give maven compile so just write compile maven compile and press enter and it's going to compile all your source files right now the third step is to give the test compile you can see our maven compile is successful and it says build success here right so the third step is to maven test hyphen compile here right so it's going to compile all our test files okay so press enter and it will run and it will uh, compile all the test source file and it says build success okay so you can see the target folder is created for us and inside this target folder we have the classes and inside the classes we have app.class created for us same as we have seen in the case of eclipse project right and we also have this test classes and then we have uh, our app test or class created for us right now the fourth command was uh, to run the test so mvn test you need to give mvn test to run your test so press enter and it's going to run all the test and if they are successful then you will see build success here so our tests are run and it's going to create this surefire hyphen report file and in this you can see we have zero failure zero errors right and the last command is to give here is mvn install to create our jar file right so let's uh, go inside the target and we will see the jar file uh, you know live created so let's give maven install and just see here what happens it will be generated right so maven install and press enter and it's going to compile all the things and run the tests and at the end our jar file is created here okay so in this way you can uh, create a jar file for your maven project i hope you enjoyed this video please wait comment subscribe 